So what are the rules of differentiation? First up is the power rule. If some function of x is equal to x to the power of n, then the derivative of the function is n multiplied by x to the power of n minus 1. For example, if the function of x is x to the power of 3, or x cubed, then the derivative of the function, or f prime of x, is equal to 3 times x to the power of 3 minus 1. This simplifies to 3x squared. Now the product rule. If the function of x is equal to some function g of x multiplied by some other function h of x, then f prime of x is g prime of x multiplied by h of x plus g of x multiplied by h prime of x. For example, if f of x is equal to x sine of x, then f prime of x is equal to the derivative of the first function, 1, multiplied by the second function, sine of x, plus the first function, x, multiplied by the derivative of the second function, cosine of x. Now, the quotient rule. If the function of x is equal to some function g of x divided by another function h of x, then the derivative of the function of x is equal to g prime of x multiplied by h of x minus g of x multiplied by h prime of x all over h of x squared. For example, if the function of x is equal to x divided by sine of x, then the derivative of the function of x is equal to the derivative of the top function, 1, times the bottom function, sine of x, minus the top function, x, multiplied by the derivative of the bottom function, cosine of x, all over the bottom function squared, sine squared of x. The chain rule. The chain rule is used for nested functions. If f of x is equal to g of h of x, then the derivative of the function of x is equal to g prime of h of x multiplied by the derivative of the inside function, h prime of x. For example, if f of x is equal to sine of x squared, then the derivative of the function of x is equal to the derivative of the outside function, cosine of x squared, multiplied by the derivative of the inside function, 2x. Some rules involving constants. If f of x is equal to some constant c, then f prime of x is equal to 0. For example, if f of x is equal to 3, then f prime of x is equal to 0. In another instance, if f of x is equal to some constant multiplied by some function g of x, then the derivative of the function of x is equal to c multiplied by g prime of x. For example, if f of x is equal to 3 multiplied by x, then f prime of x is equal to 3 multiplied by the derivative of x, or 1. And finally, the sum and difference rules. If f of x is equal to some function g of x plus some other function h of x, then f prime of x is simply equal to g prime of x plus h prime of x. 
Similarly, if f of x is equal to some function g of x minus some other function h of x, then f prime of x is equal to g prime of x minus h prime of x. For example, if f of x is equal to x plus sine of x, then f prime of x is equal to the derivative of the first function plus the derivative of the second function, 1 plus cosine of x.